We move to a top five clash of light heavyweights. Sergei Maslaboyev and Donaghy Abena. Sergei Maslaboyev. Hi, Lithuania. Lavas, Lithuania. Kavalda. Here comes the Lithuanian sledgehammer. A lot of his knockouts coming from his hands. He throws everything with power. Yeah, maybe I'm not the best fighter in the world, but I'm a tough one. Look, I like how calm Maslaboyev is. Maslaboyev tries to surprise you. He's not throwing a lot, but when he does, it's something different. He's very explosive. You know, boom, it comes out of nowhere. What a knee to the head. Has some really impressive wins on his career. I think the only thing I know what to do. It's hard that hook to the liver. And going downstairs and those hurt him. Where do you rate yourself? I rank myself number one. Well, he doesn't lack confidence, that's for sure. Fuck me about For real, huh? Here's our tale of the tape. Number three versus number five, Abena. Just 23 years old, as Joe mentioned. 207 with a three-inch reach advantage over Masla Boyev, who's 34 and 1.89 meters tall. With professional experience, very similar slight edge going to Maslaboyev, but the big advantage for them is Maslaboyev's knockout percentage. 66% of 37 fights, fantastic. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, we are scheduled for three three-minute rounds in Glory's light heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the black corner, a two-time world and European champion who brings with him a professional record of 32 wins with five losses, 21 of those wins coming by way of knockout. He is undefeated in two prior glory appearances. He stands six feet, two and a half inches, 1.89 meters, and he weighed in at fight time at an even 208 pounds, 94.5 kilos. Fighting out of Vilnius, Lithuania. He is ranked number five in the Glory World Rankings. Please welcome Sergei Kavalda Maslaboye. Now his opponent fighting out of the white corner. He won his first two Glory starts in Lyon and Strasbourg. His young professional career record, 24 wins with eight losses, six of those wins coming by way of knockout. Standing six feet, three and one half inches, 1.92 meters, he weighed in at 207 pounds, 93.9 kilos. Fighting tonight out of Suriname and rank number three in the Glory World Rankings, here is Donaghy, the silverback, Abena! The third man inside the glory ropes. Black corner, white corner. Guys, listen, we're fighting three rounds of three minutes. You know the rules, any questions? No questions. Protect yourselves at all time. Touch gloves if you want. Back to your corner. Who do you give the edge to here, Joe? <laughs> this is a tough one. I just, honestly, I, I'm going to do it. I'm going to say Judge. split down the middle, but yeah, it's, this is a tough Come one. Come on, for take me. it. Take it. I can't, side. honestly, on this one, I think it's very well matched. So Joe predicts a draw between these light heavyweights. Sergei Maslaboyev, nicknamed the Sledgehammer, and Donaghy Abena in the red trunks. I'm telling you, this is the one I've been really going back and forth with. 
one moment I watched oh, Donaghy, I was like, man, I think Donaghy's got the advantage. You watch Maslaboyev's last fight, you give him the advantage. You always wonder, Maslaboyev telling us he doesn't get good sparring in Lithuania. Of course, Donaghy Abana gets about as good as you can get. They just exchanged two big punches each. Swing and a miss for Abena. You're going to see a good mix of strikes from Maslaboya. In his debut, he got a nice right. knockdown with a scissor knee. Looked like he was running for one there. Maslaboya was supposed to fight Luis Tavares, but he broke his toe, his big toe, on a push kick. He says on Friday the 13th, I knew I shouldn't have trained that day. I, mean, I always try to hold my front kicks back in sparring when they hit the elbow, that's it. Says that wasn't low. What are you doing? Oh, Donaghy went jab to the body. And you can see Masla Boyev is not hey, happy. Stop, Stop, I always Fight. say a low blow does two things. Slows you down or makes you come extra aggressive. For the sledgehammer, he's going to come forward now. He's trying to bully Abena. Downstairs, nice right hand to the body. Now he wants to return the body shot. This is where you see Masla Boyev do well when he mixes his kicks. His punches, where Bane is all power punches on different angles. Right. Ooh, ooh. Nice low kick, perfectly timed by Abena. Yeah, tip that inside leg right out. Back to that level change. <laughs> and a, 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 a point. Says, no, that He's wasn't running. low. Yeah. Wait. You kick me in the head when it is low. There's that scissor knee that Master Boy of mixes in. But I'm liking Abena's strong, stiff jab, the way he's mixing levels. Good opening round. Right. A couple of shots below the belt, at least according to Masla Boyev's body language. But Abena with a nice start. Abena, good start. I like the way he's using his jab, and he's got to use that calculated pressure. Stay in, keep moving forward with that high guard, mixing that explosive boxing in his hands that he's known for. But I think a little bit of fainting and angle is just going to help him land a little bit more successfully. Maslaboyev, he needs to control the range. Right now, he's staying really in close. I think he needs to spread out a little bit, mix the kicks a little bit more, and try to keep counter back and try to be complete and adapt. Sometimes forward, sometimes backwards. Just don't stay in front of Abena. And this is with the low blow, but no, that was a perfect shot. Dead on for Abena. Nice jab to the body, hook to the body, and then that head kick upstairs. I mean, Maslaboyev's lucky he didn't go out because that was perfectly timed to deliver. Nice shot. Defend yourself at all times. Big Mike yelling at the referee about that low blow, I feel. Fight! So how do you think the judges saw that first rep? Well, I'm, I think it's gone to Abena, especially if the referee didn't call that, uh, you know, low blow. Four of the five judges right. do score it for Abena. Fight! I like Maslaboyev, though, coming out. Putting pressure on and letting his hands fight another well-timed kick from Abena. Yep. When Maslaboyev sits on his punches, Abena takes that leg out. Man, to me, I, it's it's crazy to think that Abena is only 23 years old. Yeah. Wild to me. When he fought Artem Vahitov, 21. Insane. But Maslaboyev's dangerous. Look at him. Right. Russell Boy of not get too concerned with kicks right now. He's going boxing. Yeah, he's fighting a little bit more emotional now, which is making this a nice, fun fight. Right! The back. Fight! Whoa! Nice right hand! That touch! Fight. 
the glove touched the ground. That could have easily been a knockdown. That could have been a flash knockdown for sure. Better round here for Maslaboyev. Maslaboyev prided himself in having good conditioning. So if that's the case, he'll have the advantage going in these last two rounds. Oh, and another perfectly timed kick. Joe, how does that throw you off your game? Well, it's just frustrating to get your legs swelled up. They don't hurt, but they're more annoying to have your slipping and off balance all the time. What? It's a smart move. And referee Edward Strykart's got his work cut out for him in this bout. Right hand just misses for a Baina. Total strikes 55 to 38 for the Lithuanian. Fight! Same, about the same number thrown. And even in the pre-fight stuff, Abena didn't really respect Maslaboyev's boxing, but seems like it's doing pretty good in the second round. Time. Yeah. Go in. Watch out. Yeah. Fight! 41 seconds roughly to go. Right to the body from Maslaboyev. Do you like when he mixes his kicks? Keeps that range a little longer, but he must be feeling better on the Straight inside. Right hand for Maslaboyev. Oh. Caught him again. Abena damaged goods for a moment. Yeah, that right hand from Maslaboyev went flush. Bainan needs to try to counter back now. He's letting Maslaboyev come too comfortable with his punches. Ooh, nice counter right from Abena. But a good round for the Lithuanian to bounce back after losing the first. Hey! Mike, reading Abena the riot act right now. Abena, that boxing-oriented power puncher. But tonight it looks like it's Maslavoya who's the boxer, not Abena. Yeah, he's doing really well. Here we have Maslavoya, nicknamed the Sledgehammer, has some very impressive wins on his career. But nothing more impressive for me than he's really trying to put a positive image for martial arts in his community in Lithuania. We saw some good power punching here from Maslaboyev, but uh, this is what Maslaboyev was calling a, a low blow. Three minutes to go, and it all comes down to this for sure. Fight! Who would you rather be right now? Well, Maslaboyev had a great round, so probably Maslaboyev, but. I like that Abena's using that jab again because the jab set up a lot of stuff for him in that first round. All five judges giving that to Maslaboyev, so the winner of the third wins the fight. Now Abena mixing his low kicks, but I think that jab's gonna set things up for him. Right. Whether it's power right hand or his low kick, the jab's there for him. Fight! Maslaboyev carries a lot of muscle into the ring. Baina looking better this round than he did in the second. Throwing a little bit more, countering, keeping his distance. Hey. Under two to go. Baina using the legs. Maslaboyev almost exclusively with the hands. Yeah, he's crashing that distance now, too. Doesn't want to keep a Bane at range for power. Crashes. Jumping right. knee for Maslaboyev. What? It's anyone's fight at this stage. 
Oh. oh nice high kick from Abeda. While he was leaning back against the ropes, sometimes that can give you, I would assume, a little extra oomph. Yeah, it kind of lets you not fall backwards. This round is dead even in my eyes. A quick glance at the clock from Master Boyev. Stand up. Minute to go. Big one, two. This fatigue setting it for both men. Boy, you're right, Joe. This third round is extremely close. So my early prediction was pretty good, wasn't it? Which was a draw. <laughs> Basically. Yeah. yeah, not bad. I told you. I've been going back and forth when I was studying this fight. Again, the winner of the next 30 seconds probably wins the fight. You have to think the next fight would be, you know, Tavares and Vahitov. This could easily be the next guy ready to go, waiting. Who's, which guy? <laughs> the winner here. That's why it's so important. Keep in mind, if it is indeed tied after three rounds, we do go to an extra round. Yep. You don't see too many 10-10 rounds in glory. Was that worthy? It's going to be tough. If anything, I'm sure the judges might pick a side and could split it open. But, uh, man, tough fight to call. And here Ladies and gentlemen, this bout goes the distance. So we go to the judges' scorecard. Let's take a look at the totals from our five ringside judges. Two judges score the bout 29-28, Maslavoyev. Two judges have it 29-28, Abena. And our fifth and final judge scores the bout 30-27 for your winner by split decision. Sergey Maslavoyev! What a win for Sergey Maslaboyev, the sledgehammer from Lithuania, unbeaten in glory now, 3-0, and and he is standing by with our own Mark Schaaf in the ring. I'm here with uh, Sergey, the winner of the fight by split decision, Sergey. Some love between the guys. I love everybody. <laughs> I know, you seem, when you walk up, you're a really relaxed and nice guy, but when the bell goes, when You're I, all out. When I walk, uh, go out to the ring, you see my, my hands are like this. When I'm doing like this, I'm sending love to all the people around me. To all the people who are here. Thank you, guys. I really love you. I know that when you give, give, give good, good emotions to people, the good comes back always. So thank you. Now, it was a very close match. Did you feel it was so close, or did you think that you won easily? Oh, uh, no, not easily. Uh, it's, it's normal that I fought maybe 50% of my, uh, fit, only 50% of my skills. Two years with no fighting, a lot of pressure. And after two years of break, uh, the guys 
get higher in the rankings than me felt a lot of pressure. When you saw that his punches didn't make no damage to me, but I was like wobbling all the time because couldn't feel the ground. This is my problem. I know where, where I uh, done something wrong and I will be better next time, you see, I promise you. Awesome, give it up for Sergei Mazloboyev. Lietuva. Again. Uh, I saw Let's take a look at those judges' scorecards. One saw all three rounds for Maslaboyev. The rest of them is like cutting yeah. up a pizza. Yeah, I was telling you, it was a tough fight to call. I mean, you can watch that back and probably think Abena won, Maslaboyev won, but what matters is these judges. Well, the only round they were all in agreement on was round number two.